I've said it once, I'll say it again. The streets with the most public nudity are probably the safest streets. Shouldn't high visibility be part of Vision Zero? If drivers could see people walking, they wouldn't hit people walking, right? We need high visibility clothing. Look, it shouldn't matter what you wear. In fact, you should be able to run naked through the streets and survive. There's nothing wrong with high visibility clothing. There's nothing wrong with wearing a reflective vest to catch people's attention. Construction workers wear these things all the time, especially on the highway. There's a reason they wear that stuff on the highway. When you're going 60 or 70 miles an hour, you're not expecting to see a person walk around with a shovel. If we start mandating a certain type of clothing, then what we're saying is you have to wear this type of clothing in order to remain safe. That sort of thinking shifts the blame from the high speed motorist to the very low speed and vulnerable pedestrian. Here's where we do want high visibility on the desks of the planners and engineers that are giving us deadly infrastructure. That's where we want a giant spotlight. I want high visibility engineering, not high visibility clothing. White pants might be okay between Labor Day and Memorial Day, but after that you need to wear dark clothing. So what kind of things would we see if we had high visibility planning and high visibility engineering? It could get ugly. You'd probably see things like a design speed that's way above the posted speed to encourage people to drive fast. You'd probably see 12 foot or wider lanes. You'd probably see large turning radius to encourage people to drive fast around those corners where those soft squishy pedestrians are headed. You might see protected bike lanes cast aside because we don't do that kind of thing in our state. And you might see that future road planning is built on the ridiculous prophecies of traffic engineering models. If a bridge collapses over a river, you're not concerned about the white stripes or the yellow stripes leading up to the edge of the abyss. You're worried about fixing that bridge that fell into the river. If you're truly worried about 30 to 40,000 Americans who are killed in car traffic every year, you're not going to be worried about high visibility clothing right now you're going to be worried about high visibility engineering. You're not going to focus on what people are wearing. You're going to focus on what people are designing. Keep streets safe for people running around in their birthday suits.